We reached out to police, two police departments, including the one behind me, and it is clear police are worried about rising gas prices. More bicycle patrols, more motorcycle patrols, more foot patrols. Spring Garden Police Chief George Swartz says they are real possibilities for his department as they deal with rising fuel prices. What could possibly, you know, cause us to look at our, our patrolling strategies? So far, it's not impacting police services in Spring Garden or in neighboring York City. But Commissioner Michael Modro is gearing up. E-bikes will hit the streets in a few weeks. The original concept was a new way for officers to get around the city, but the energy savings is obvious. With the number that we bought, I'm sure that that will definitely be able to help support our patrol efforts and cut down on gas prices. One new purchase by York Police will definitely have an impact. We actually just recently purchased our first, uh, our, our first fully electric vehicle. Muldrow says if fuel prices continue to stay high. You will definitely see more of the electric vehicles at, worked in our fleet moving forward. And you'll see that first York City Police electric car on the streets of the city toward the end of this year. In York, Ed Weinstock, WGAL News 8.